in medicine and money tips on how to save money on prescription drugs and find that they are more accessible. Joining us now is JC Scott, president and CEO of the Pharmaceutical Care Management Association. Thank you for coming on our show, JC. And how has the COVID-19 pandemic affected patients' access to prescription medication? Well, to me, there's two parts to the accessibility question. First, of course, is affordability. If you can't afford your prescription, then you're not going to be able to access it. And, and central to the work that we do as PVMs is trying to address that affordability question. The second piece, of course, is physical access. How do you make sure you can get your medication when you need your medication? And I, I'll tell you from my personal experience, I've used mail service pharmacy as an option for a number of years to get my cholesterol medication delivered right to my doorstep. It's convenient. It's reliable. And it's really helped me to stay adherence to that, that medication regime because I get it like clockwork in the mail every three months. Uh, it's something that I think can work for a lot of people. Multiple companies have come out with the effectiveness of COVID-19 vaccines. What are some ways to ensure all Americans have access to that immunization? It's a great question. And I, and I always like to pause as we talk about the vaccine and just feel excited and optimistic about where we are, right? We have two therapies on the market. There's a third on the way. Uh, I think about my mom down in Florida who's signed up and in line hoping to get her first shot in the in the coming days or weeks. There's light at the end of, end of the tunnel, which I think is terrific. And for our part, uh, what PBMs are doing, I think, is central to the question you asked. We're trying to connect the dots to make sure people have information about where to go and how to get access to that vaccine. It varies a little bit uh, depending on your state or locality, but we're here to be a resource uh, to help you figure out how to navigate that system so that uh, we can get you know, as many shots and as many arms as possible to get us out of the situation we're all in. To learn more about the work that we're doing at, at PCMA, you can visit pcmanet.org. And of course, if you have health insurance, look on the back of your health insurance card. It'll have information on how to contact your specific PBM to answer questions about how you get access to the vaccine and, and other needs with your prescription drugs. Well, thank you for helping us out today. Thanks so much for having me on. Since first AM, check us out on social media. We're on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter, and go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.